Skyler is like any other normal high school. She works hard on academics, even with a dyscalculia, and she has a passion for work-based learning and job experience. Math is a really big challenge for me. Um, I had to have a lot of teacher help for it, um, but I try to excel and do my best as I possibly can. So when I was younger, I was born with dyscalculia, which is basically dyslexia with numbers. It's kind of the same thing, but it makes it a little more challenging dyslexia because it's not really something you can grow out of. It really depends on fonts a lot of the time, but eights, zeros, sixes get confused a lot, threes and fives get confused a lot, and depending on the fonts, fours and nines get confused. Um, if I count something, it helps a lot. I can write the number in my own letter or have someone tell me the number so I can finish what I'm doing. Pascal's family dynamics is what makes her unique. She's was, she was adopted by her grandparents at a very young age, and she says it changed her life. I'm 16. I'm a junior. Um, I got adopted by my grandparents when I was really young. I have a dog named Holly. She's a rescue. Um, I have an older brother. He graduated last, last year. Um, my birth parents um, didn't take good care of me. My birth father left when I was when my mom was pregnant with me. We don't know who he really is. She has a lot of mental health issues and didn't really know how to raise a child. And it wasn't the best environment for me, so my grandparents took me in. It definitely changed how I grew up. I wouldn't be the same person I am now if I stayed in that environment. I'd probably be out on the street at this point. <laughs> so I'm grateful. My dad works a lot. So um, I don't really see him that much. My mom, she's kind of a, she's an interesting person, to say the least. So she doesn't really help around much. And then I have a grandmother who practically raised me. Like she was my matern motherly figure, not maternity, motherly figure growing up. It was mainly my dad and my great-grandmother raising me. I mainly work. It's fouling out in Arlington, like right across the street from Olympic. I've worked multiple jobs at multiple times, trying to get a little extra money in to help my family out and stuff. The most jobs I've worked at one time was five while trying to balance school. <laughs> a lot of the time, I'm trying to fix my car at the moment. It's a 94 Mustang GT. It was very stressful, and I had to cancel a lot of plans just to make it in.